Greetings in this video. I want to help you fix your TCL flat screen TV if it no longer turns on or you just get a black screen. Stay with me until the end because I probably have a solution for you. And just let's just hope that there's not some issue with the bulb inside. Most likely that there's not. So the first easiest thing to do is make sure it's not your remote. So if you try to power on your remote and you can't get it to turn on, just manually go to the back wherever your power button is on the back locate it and see if you can turn it on from there and of course make sure the TV is plugged up okay next thing what you're going to do is you want to do a soft reset so what I want you to do is unplug it for about 60 seconds so let's go ahead and unplug it and then give it 60 seconds and then after the 60 seconds plug it back in and then see if it'll turn on. If that doesn't work, unplug it again. And what I want you to do is point your remote to the TCL and hold down the power button for a total of 30 seconds. Just hold it down while it's unplugged. And count it out to 30 seconds. Release. And then go on the very, very back. Locate the power. And then hold it down for 30 seconds. Release, plug it back in, and see if that will work. Now, the majority of TCLs have a reset button on the back near the uh, USB and the HDMI connection, and it looks something like this. So what you're gonna need to do is get you a little paper clip or a safety pin, something like this. Locate the reset button on the back this particular one does not have one, but it, like I showed you in, here in this picture, it looks like that. And what you want to do is you want to hold it down and push it down firmly into the hole of the reset button for 20 seconds. Release and see if that works. I want you to go ahead and do that with the with it plugged in though. And if you have it powered on, try to power it on like that. Do it both with it unplugged and plugged up. Okay, if you haven't tried this yet on your remote look for either the menu button or the settings button and then if you can see it powered on if you have a red light on the bottom see if you can turn it on or if you hear it try to hit the menu button and the settings button just turn it on and off several times and see if you can see the menu and the settings button the good news is, is if you do see the menu pop up or the settings then you know there's, there's nothing wrong internally and if that's the case see if you can navigate to brightness or somewhere in the settings where you can increase the brightness of it so it's a possibility somebody somebody may be playing a joke on you or you may have accidentally put a dim uh, settings on there so go ahead and do that now next thing I want you to do is unplug it again and what we're going to do now is we're going to use, use a hair dryer to warm up the components in the back but make sure that your TV is unplugged and what we're going to do with the hair dryer you're going to put it on high blowing warm temperature what you're going to do is you're going to blow in these vents here for about one minute while it's unplugged and then after we release that we're going to keep it unplugged for about 30 minutes let it cool down and what that's doing is it's heating the components up and changing the chemistry of it and it's knocking any loose dust out in the TV. So basically anywhere you can find a vent, go ahead and blow inside. Now like I said, about after 30 minutes, plug it up and then see if it'll turn on. Now last but certainly not least, is check your power cord so physically check your power cord on the TCL and make sure that there's no damage on it and if you see that there is damage on it or you suspect it could possibly be the cord and if it does unplug from the TV most most of them do this right here is a non polarized figure 8 cord it's a generic cord some of the TCLs will have like three little holes here like a like a triple cord and some will be uh, polarized where there's like an X on the bottom 
these are generic generic they're easy to find you might have like for example this one's a non-polarized you might have one laying around the house on a printer or Xbox or PlayStation temporarily remove it from that electronic and try it on your TCL you're not going to hurt anything and then if it starts working then you know the only thing you need to do is replace your cord and then I can put in the description where you can get these cords at you you come here you yes you I need your help come here you see this right here this walls empty I need a YouTube play button in order for me to get a YouTube play button, I need 100,000 subscribers. I got, what, 20, 30,000 right now? I need 100. I need you, please, you, to subscribe. You think, my subscription doesn't help. Yes, it does. I need 100,000. I need. I visualize. I visualize what I want in this world.